Right, today we have kind of a little bit of a busy day, but at the same time we don't really have that busy, busy, blah, blah, busier of a day. Um, first ask, let's change it the bills. Um, we, I attempted to recover the rake, uh, under the bridge, and it failed dramatically, um, tried to ain't any good for it, <laughs> it needs fair track, to be perfectly honest with you, um, tried to it on the riverbank, it got stuck on a tree, and I'd fall back onto an older save. Which took some figuring out to do, but I figured it. Um, then put the phone in, so then that way I can make phone calls. I need to empty every network so I know what's going where. Um, yeah. Plan for today is going to try and build the car. Dun dun dun! Um, as you guys will know, I've already built the interior. I've built in the GT parts. Uh, so all I need to do is build the engine and put the other stuff on. So that is the plan of action for today. And for some reason, I've got a whole ton of urine in my room. I don't quite know how I've got it in there. But if you have a look, I've got a bit of a flood in my room. Yeah. I really wish you would add a way where you can clean the floor and mop it and stuff. I also need to uh, refill the trail of firewood. That's the other job I need to do, desperately do. Because what I want to do is the next time the wood job comes in, I want to also do a kill you run at the same time. So then that way I can do the kill you guy as well, get keep him happy. But also get an extra bit of money in. And this is the best bit. I bought myself the ratchet set. And it came in the post. I am so excited. I need to unload everything. This is the boring part. Oh, click up, you stupid train. So at least now I can use the ratchet set, which will make my life a ton easier. But not only that, it might actually tighten it a little bit better than uh, the spanner set. But what I will do as well is fill up the uh, tractor with more wood. I need to fill up this with fuel. Because I, yes, I did have to actually use it. Surprise, surprise.
Oh, stand up, right, you stupid thing. That's what you have to kickstand for. <coughs> so reasonably full, but I want to completely... Wow. Pick up you stupid thing. <sighs> Fall over again, I'm going to not throw you up with fuel. There we go. Did it just filled all the way up to the brim? I feel I need to fill up with this is a remote because I can't remember if I filled it up last time I used it. <laughs> so we're going to reset the fuel level in the boat and then we will see what happens from here. Um, so yeah, we try and build the car today. Not one bit looking forward to building it, but. I find it bad at the same time, it's just tedious, very tedious in my light books, but it is what it is at the end of the day, and hopefully, if I can build this in, say, two or three videos, Uncle might actually lose his license a little bit quicker, because I desperately need to get a hold of the track. Because there is a wreck in that direction, which requires a lot of of work, and just even to pull it out onto the road into a terrible position is going to be a task on its own. definitely filled up last time I did it then. So, what are we going to do then? So, build the car. Um, fill up the truck. I need to fill up the truck first, actually. Uh, I'm debating on which around I should do it. Mm, yeah, I'll do the car first. Because in that way, if I can get get it licensed and everything, before we even take it for MOT, I'm going to get Ferrari to repair everything on it, paint it, and replace the front windshield since I've managed to break it somehow. Still don't know how. Um, I need to fill the tractor bar up over there, up with diesel. Um, oh, it's 
do I need to do? Sorry guys, I'm trying to sort something out. So I took something out then for a sec. I do reply to all your guys' comments. Um, you can comment on the older videos as well. I do reply to them. Or at least try and part them if I can. so much better to have a full tank of fuel rather than running it practically empty. Let's grab a shower and a drink and something to hmm, do I do? Don't really want anything to eat right now. Come on, that's not so clean. Oops, so button. Batteries charging for the car, the new one that is. So, first task is clearing up this mess. What I would like to do, if we were allowed to, was 
get either a skylight or um, a window put in, even if it's on the side here, just so they can more natural light. And also being able to mow your lawn, that would be another cool feature. Have like a little ride on mower or something. So I'm just going to get the rest of this gear away. It's so most likely I'll just use the uh, ratchet set now. Now that I have it to uh, finish building the car and I'm going to definitely move the tractor first before I build anything because in that way the tractor isn't in our way once I've finished building the car I am going to deep clean the uh, garage out I'm hoping I'll have enough bottles by now that I have accumulated, but I need to do a count and make sure I have all of them. That's a good thing. I've just noticed that. We've got another source of income now. Yes! Oops. This is what I've been waiting for. Oops, I have overstayed this massively. 
So now I can actually do what I do best, and that's commercial driving. That is a very welcome bonus for me. I was not expecting to see him. Yeah, I really wasn't expecting to see that. But, holy mackerel, that's a very good sign. Uh, things might actually start going the way I want them to now. And, to be fair, we could actually sort the truck down here with the van. Lowering down the boom or the arm, as you like to call it. Holy cow, I was not expecting to see Uncle. Though, that's the one thing that kind of took me by surprise. So, uh, let's go and see what Uncle has to say. We'll still work in the car. It just means we've got other methods of transport now. We've got the truck and the van, which is a very good sight to see and a very good thing for us because it now means Uncle can't drive at all. I was speeding and I got caught, so I so I lost my driver's license. I could have explained that I need need it for my job, but well. I haven't exactly paid my income taxes, so basically in legal terms, I'm not doing any work either. He he. I was thinking if you want to start driving the truck, you can get some extra income easily. But it costs an arm and leg just to fill up the darn thing. Because you never leave me for enough fuel. I just sit here and enjoy my government imposed unemployment. Sort of like it was sorry, when the police say stop working. I... 
Oh, look at this. Yeah. Right, so at least we've now got another pair of keys. I was not expecting that at all for like another week. So that's a good thing. So, uh, what time are we on? So I'm going to end the video here. I hope you have enjoyed it. If you have, please send me a big thumbs up. Any comments, queries or concerns, let me know by commenting in the comment section below. And so next time guys, keep safe and I'll see you in the next one. Bye bye. Alright guys, just for you you click on another video. For us mention about the new essential trackers handbook by Malcolm Green. This book is absolutely ram packed with everything from ADR to taco regulations or tachograph regulations, weights strapping, roping and sheeting, everything you need to know is within this book. If you're interested in guess one, there's a link in my video description to where you can buy one. Cheers guys, bye!